My name is Danielle Pace. I am the Chief Pharmacist Officer for the Canadian Pharmacists Association. Pharmacy brings together two of my favorite things. Science, I've always loved it. Chemistry was my favorite subject in school. And people, I love being able to help people. My grandmother has always been my inspiration. She is bold and fearless and has a heart of gold. And like most grandparents, as she got older, her health needs became more complex. When I saw the relationship my grandmother had with her pharmacist, it inspired me. She was so patient and kind and really made the knowledge accessible for my grandmother. I realized that I wanted to be that person for others so that I could make a difference in their lives too. So I started my career in the pharmaceutical industry. I loved the idea of being able to create medicine to help cure people. But I soon realized that I was a little too removed from the direct impact really wanted to meet the people that I was helping. Pharmacy gave me the opportunity to really make a connection there. Now that I'm the Chief Pharmacist Officer, I'm excited to share my passion and my energy in this role. It is a true pleasure and a privilege to make a difference for our profession and to help the lives of Canadians everywhere. CPHA has been around since 1907, and we've been there for all the major milestones in the world of pharmacy. We're now embarking on a new chapter, and we're ready to embrace the future. My role as CPO is to engage and represent the community of pharmacy. I will be listening really closely to what Canadian pharmacists have to say, and then I will bring that insight back to the leadership team at CPHA so that it can guide and inform the decisions being made. Pharmacists have a lot on their plate. We are playing an essential role in helping Canadians stay healthy. And as an organization, CBHA wants to do everything they can to support us. Part of that includes advocating on important health issues, such as the opioid crisis, Indigenous health, and drug shortages. CBHA wants to work collaboratively with other stakeholders so that we can address important issues such as the mental health and well-being of our pharmacy workforce. My role is to be the national voice of Canadian pharmacists, to make sure that you're top of mind with key stakeholders and decision makers. I see a future where we harness the full potential of pharmacists. I would love to see pharmacists from coast to coast connected so we can share our stories, learn from each other, and engage with the Pharmacists Association. I envision a thriving profession that is supported by an association that embraces our diversity, cultivates our ideas, and supports us with the knowledge we need for the future. COVID-19 has really affected our profession. We've been able to demonstrate the essential role pharmacists play in Canadian healthcare. As pharmacists, our job is to help our patients, but we also need support. CPHA wants to be a champion for the health and wellness of pharmacists. We want to help address the underlying cause that are leading to stress and burnout. Our new strategic plan is designed to support you no matter what lies ahead. We are committed to being an innovative, progressive organization. And at the forefront of this renewed direction is a commitment to meet the needs of frontline pharmacy professionals. We'll be able to do this by offering relevant clinical content, such as our newly branded CPS, as well as practice tools, services, and advocating for Canadian pharmacists on a national stage. As the role of the pharmacist continues to evolve, we're gonna need new skills and resources in order to improve our impact and our efficiency. Over the next few years, CPHA will be investing into new tools, products, and services to help us help the public. By advocating for you and empowering you in your practice, we are also advocating for the health of all Canadians. Canadians are seeing the true value of their pharmacists, no more so than during the COVID-19 pandemic. We've given out over 10 million doses of COVID-19 vaccine, and that's something to be proud of. And there's still so much we can do. Your postal code should not determine the level of care that your pharmacist is able to provide. 
And so we need to continue our work to ensure that pharmacists in every corner of the country can practice to their full scope. Together, we can help address inequities in access to medication and pharmacy-led services. Pharmacists can play an important role in addressing the gaps that exist in our system. That includes helping patients achieve positive health outcomes through disease state management, point of care testing, vaccinations, and common ailment prescribing. We are on a mission to redefine the way healthcare looks in Canada. I envision a thriving pharmacy profession where we're integrated into our healthcare teams, working collaboratively and using technology to improve the lives of Canadians.